So Don Corum is a results-oriented person. That's what makes him different than Lauren Boebert. Now, these, this is about some of the comments that were made at the virtual forum, some sort of Zoom meeting where you had all the CO3 candidates were there. Alex Walker was there. Adam Frisch was there. Lauren Boebert, Don Corum, and Sol Sandoval. Now, Don Corm, he said he looked into the congresswoman's record and he just couldn't find any successes that were connected to the congresswoman. Don Corm said that Lauren Boebert likes to say that she introduced this bill or that bill, but the key operative word is pass. We didn't elect a congresswoman just to introduce some bills, but we wanted to get some bills passed, at least one bill passed. Can Lauren Boebert point to one bill being passed? Don Corm also points out that Lauren Boebert takes credit for things she voted against. Lauren Boebert said last year that the health care of veterans wasn't her problem. But Don Corm disagrees. He thinks that the health care of veterans is her problem. Now Adam Frisch had pointed out that Lauren Boebert didn't even win her home district because the local conservative media had turned against her there. Lauren Bober didn't even win her home district. Solson Davos said we need to we need to elect an adult who knows how to listen. That's interesting. We need to elect an adult who knows how to listen, said Solson Davos. Alex Walker said public lands absolutely should not be open to oil and gas development. Lauren Bober said it was imperative. Alex Walker told Lauren Bobert on the Zoom virtual foreman that she was a on the Zoom virtual forum that she was a huge part of the problem. Alex Walker was the only one to call for an, a ban on assault weapons, which he got applause for. Lauren Boebert said she was pro-life, and then Lauren Boebert said that Planned Parenthood can go fund themselves. Alex Walker has called for the renegotiation of the Colorado River Compact in 1922. Don Corm doesn't even... No, if Lauren Boebert knows what the Colorado River Compact in 1922 is after Lauren Boebert had been dropped out after the first round of the debate, Sol Sandoval said, well, adios. I guess it's adios to Lauren Boebert. Now, here's some other comments they have made. What's your top economic priority? Adam Frisch, he said his top economic priority is getting inflation under control. It's not too hard for the average Colorado to afford a simple, comfortable lifestyle for the family. I've seen the last 15 years. I spent the last 15 years working on affordable housing solutions in the Roaring Fork Valley and have learned what it takes to get. He also wants to address the root problems in our supply chain and government, government spending, increase workers' wages, support small business without unnecessary and burdensome regulations. Inflation. Adam Frisch is going to get inflation under control. Sol Sandoval, her top economic priority is to develop the workforce to get we, the working class families of the CO3, some apprenticeships and trade schools and job training for people who are already working and looking for better paying jobs through more skills. Alex Walker said, together we could turn CD3 into a clean job superpower. Lauren Boebert said, my priority, my priority is to restore the proven principles of the American First agenda. That starts with putting American first, workers first, getting the government out of the business of choosing winners and losers, reducing dependency and sticking up for ourselves around the world. We prove this approach elevates all of our citizens economically, keeps peace around the world, and allows us to prosper in an environment where jobs are plentiful. Inflation is low, and the goods and services we need as a country are readily available. Don Corm said families in the 3rd Congressional District in rural Colorado are being hurt by record inflation and supply chain issues. It's crucial our representatives in Congress work immediately to address and remove government barriers that are increasing the cost of heating our homes, filling up gas tanks, and buying groceries. Don Corm is in favor of a farmer's market. He says Lauren Boebert needs prepared remarks because she can't think on her feet. Don Corm is opposed to illegal immigration, but he favors a pathway to citizenship. Unlike that all, Corm. 
Don Corm actually believes in being compassionate to Don Corm understands the Colorado River Compact. He voted for the Colorado Office of New Americans. Lauren Berber's pro Second Amendment said Don Corm was corrupt because of his hemp farm. It was supposed to have made $25 million pro controlled burns. Where's Lauren Berber at on Smokey the Bear? Alex Walker is anti universal health care and pro gun control. What, health? No, I don't care about your all's lives. Gun control? Yes, I do want to take power away from you. Yes. I don't care about your lives or your health, but I do want to take the power away from Adam Frisch is for big oil and big gas.